Welcome to another episode of Crazy Town Gaming, where we're the voice inside your head. I'm Jonas. I'm TNT9. I'm Mike the Explosive One, and we have a very special guest with us today. The, oh. elusive, the elusive, the illustrious, the industrious, the pragmatic, the asthmatic, the craftmatic adjustable, <laughs> Mr. X. Thank you, sir. It's hard to play with the thesaurus in your hand, isn't it? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Mr. Put that down. <laughs> Welcome back. So, yeah, well, welcome Thank back. Thank you. Thank you. It's good to be back. It's nice here in the Crazy Town compound. A nice, beautiful summer day. It is a beautiful summer day. It is. Hey, is that a floating? Is that the Linnell? That is, no, Jones. We, like you were here last week. You know what that is. Right? <laughs> is that our dragon? I'm, gonna, I'm just going to start referring you to last week's episode. because. Uh, but what if someone didn't watch? I want them to know what's happening. Uh, So, I mean, I can explain that. What? Like. Well, I don't even know what that dragon is. What is it? Is that Jonas. Zelda? We literally, Jonas, stop. <laughs> You're lying to me. I'm not Jonas. You are lying. I'm not. You are here for it. Either, either way, look, last week we beat the game. Mr. X, we finally beat the game. Congratulations. Thank you. It That's took, a big deal. It took a little while. It took like three shots for me to beat the boss. Thank and you. now we are collecting on a promise that I made to one of our subscribers. Yeah. And we are going to be getting the sticky armor, the froggy armor that makes you so that you can stick onto surfaces. But I noticed that there was a fairy up here, so I figured I'd come and see oh. what she was doing. You didn't tell me you had a surprise. I mean, I just noticed it when I turned the game uh, on, actually, so it's not really a you surprise. You make your armor stronger, though. Uh, she usually wants you to do something for her first, but I'll at least see what she wants me to do. Don't they all? Do uh, you want to do a voice, Mr. X? I can. Would you like me to? Wonderful. Oh, I'm happy to read it. All so, right, cool. So who am I, the great fairy Miha? Yeah, you're a great fairy Miha. All right, Miha makes me think of, away with you. I don't want anything to do with the world ruined by gloom and ruled by monsters. All right, Miss Cleo. <laughs> <laughs> He's cramped in my flower bud, but better out there. I'll keep my blessing of clothing enhancement to myself. Okay, I mean, I'm in Mexican, Miss Cleo. <laughs> That's right. Senora Cleo, to you. <laughs> Until I hear the sound of a horn bringing some lively music into the world. I'll never go outside again, mija. Her name is mija, not you. Oh, sorry. I moved here to be near a stable or near enough anyway. So I could grace more travelers with my blessings. But now, until I hear the sound of a horn bringing lively music into the world, I'll never go outside again. Wait, are we getting the golden horse? Yeah, we are going for the golden horse currently. That's right. I remember, but I don't know what the big flying thing is. That was the Thunder Greelock that killed me at the end of last episode. Oh, and that's, I literally asked you that, and you were like, you know what it is. Like, yeah, well, I mean, you did, you did know. You did know, though. That's the I thing. I literally asked if that's what it was. Well, I didn't want to answer you because I don't like it when you act senile, all right? Oh, my God. I can't I help don't like it. Hey, Jonas bro. is getting a little older, he man. He is, and it's very clear. I'm geriatric, okay? He grunts when he gets up. I'm like, ugh. Jonas had a birthday recently. He's yeah, getting a lot turned older. Sixty, bro. Leave me be. I know. I went to his. I went to his birthday party. I got called the N word. I heard. I heard about that. It was a great time. It was a great time. We gonna bring. We gonna bring that back up and talk no, about it. Oh, okay. We don't need to talk about it. Anymore. Right, but we. I talked about it enough. It's fine. There's a whole episode on it. Well, my birthday was a few was a week or two ago too. But oh, happy uh, birthday, man! No n no words. No n words flying around no. at my birthday party. No, <laughs> not even like no. a. A spicy one? Not, <laughs> even, not even a spicy or an ironic one. None no, of, not none even of an ironic one. <laughs> no, not neither. <laughs> the ironic ones are the ones that I'm just like, you know what? You're all right. Yeah, I, you're here for that. I yeah, get it. You earned it. <laughs> all right. So we are looking for the golden horse. The go I think I see it. I see a dead horse. What's that? What the freaking hell? You want to beat oh, it? there it is. Oh, uh, it's a choo-choo. The hell is that thing? There's no way my entire oh. team is going to let this thing hit me, right? There's no way that my entire team of guys is going to let it. Here we go. They probably weren't, didn't know what it was. Choo-choo jelly? Yeah. Uh, go get that golden I, horse. I've seen white choo-choo jelly before, but it didn't look like that. Hey. <laughs> oh, this guy's making sex jokes. Hey, oh. Yeah, I mean, we're five seconds in. It's about the jism. <laughs> well, you were talking about sticky armor. I wasn't sure. I didn't want to bring that one up. Hey. <laughs> is it made by Durex is the next <laughs> question. <laughs> 
uh, the high school girls, getting, right? Getting the old jizz. No, no, no. The views expressed on this. I was just saying, they're, they're in high school. They should agree. learn all of the stuff that they need for life to become you know what? women You should society. put the yeah. shovel down because you're just digging yeah, the hole deeper. Big hole over <laughs> <You're> <laughs> digging deeper. Put <laughs> no. the shovel down, yeah, TNT. Yeah, put it down. Yeah, fair enough. I mean, yeah. you, know. you keep hey, TNT, TNT. Wasn't wasn't any context just, in there? Ju- hey, just keep looking for the jizz jacket or whatever it is you're looking for here. The jizz. Gotcha, B word. Gotcha, bitch. Tame Sue. Sue. Ooh, man, this is like rodeo. I'm, oh, I really hope you. Like, oh, oh, you, off, you, you gotta ran, keep your heels up, man. I ran out of stamina. That's what happened was. Uh, so when you're busting Bronx, you want to make sure to keep your heels kill the moose. out. What the hell are you going to do with that? Beat its meat. There's, look at all this meat it drops. You're going to beat its what? <laughs> beat, I'm not going to beat its meat. That's insane. I like that, though. It's funny. I'm here for it. Take out the Vissy. We're going to put this on our shield so I can uh, take to the sky here. It's in our book. Take a look. So you need a lot of stamina here. I might not even have the stamina to you do this. You have enough this. to get the Master Sword, but not enough to get the Gold Horse. I find that hard to believe. That's big facts. Eh, if you're, you know, if you've never actually tamed a horse Frickin before. hell, hell in my Damn, that thing got you once. All right, well, we're going to use the old way then. All right. So you learned a lesson. Don't approach horses from the rear. <laughs> is that is yeah that i mean like, that's that's a that's that a pretty classic like wranglers that, trick? It, it is it is you don't want to sue because they'll kick hey all right keep your heels out one hand keep one hand eight seconds <laughs> yeah. uh, what the hell is this thing made of man gold right so i'm gonna this time i'm gonna try eating while i'm on the horse's back to maintain my stamina reserve uh, that's a good idea i like it. i'm going to the rodeo next week no shit. Yeah, I wanted to see bull riding, and I've and I've heard there might not be bull riding. What rodeo are you going? going? To Cedar Park. The really? Hell, yeah. The hell are you going to the rodeo yeah. for? I want to see bull riding in person. You never seen it? No. Oh, it's fun. No, yeah, the, I only want to see. Ohio. And like somebody told me that they thought it's only going to be roping events, and if I go and all it is is cowboys roping broncos, I'm going to be upset. Yeah, uh, they rope calves. They don't rope broncos, but yeah. All right, we're gonna I've eat. been to lots of rodeos, and they're fun. But but yeah, bull riding. That's what I want to see. It's got to be a PBR professional bull riding uh, event for there to be bulls. It has to be that. Well, yeah, because the bull riders are different. Because it's a different kind of rodeo. Like, like the Austin rodeo has all of it, but yeah, not, they don't oh, all. No. Have it. So you might want to check the God check the it. event schedule. Oh. oh, look, he got the horse. Look at, look at horse him ride. Acquired. Shadow facts. You old s. Why you over there talking about Ben Gay and your insurance plans? That was over your handling business. Ooh. We're talking about rodeos. He's doing the rodeo. Oh, <laughs> no, no, no. It says professional events such as bareback riding. Whoa. Yeah, I don't even know what that that's means. That's bronc riding. Bro. Bull riding. There you go. Half roping and more. So. Okay, you'll have all of it. Yeah, all that's right, good. Cool. As long as I get to see a man thrown off a bull and maybe someone get a hole put in their body where it not was not there at the beginning of the day, I'm in. Yeah, as long as possible. I get to see an animal held in captivity abused against his will. <laughs> Jesus Christ. I'm sorry. It's not like it's oh, Sea World. It's don't... not like it's Sea World. You're actually, you know, you're going. Yeah, to... it's not like they're. It's not like they're killing Shamu. You never know. Is this where I'm supposed. Look, horse. He's good. I'm no genius here, but you know, shouldn't you like not run into walls? That is a draft horse, actually. Is that a draft horse? Is that yeah. what that? Well, is? just look at the, how stocky the legs are. That's a that's a horse. Does a draft horse bred to tell us more? Well, draft horses you typically bred to pull carriages and things and sleighs. Why so is it a draft horse? Well, they're stronger. They're more beefy. It wouldn't be like a racing horse they're or beefy. Oh. Oh, or like a not cutting built horse. For speed. They're built for endurance. Built built for strength. Oh. Right, so they're not built for. Uh, All right, got to get two thick boys together. To yeah, do that. I'd like to turn in this here horse. Excuse me, I don't know. I like to turn in this horse. Hold on, hold on. Stop the horse. I don't know how to work these things. All right, a horse. I, I really don't. I don't. You got to kind of kick them and they'll go you only forward. Have princess cupcakes or cookies and cooks and cream. I want to talk. It says My Little Pony. I want to talk. You might have to get off the horse, man. But is it gonna run off? There we go. Welcome, welcome. You've reached Snowfield Stable. Thank you for supporting the stable accusation. 
<laughs> since this is your first, I didn't read it before it left the screen. Since this is your first time here, we'll add one point to your pony pass points. Oh, I love when you get pony pass points. Oh, looks like you've got some points saved up, Link. If you want, you can get your reward step up to the counter where I keep the ledger. And call me over. Now then, once again, wait, Link, that horse. Isn't that the golden horse that ran away from our stable? I don't know what to say. Thank you so much for going to the trouble. Of oh, he's not going to pay back. you for it. He's going to say it's already his horse. <laughs> but Harlow uh, was the one looking after that horse. So would you mind uh, bringing it to her so she can take it around back? Yeah, sure. Yeah, yeah. Where's she at? Go find that harlot. Let's go find her. Uh, yeah, goodbye. We're good. I'll register this horse uh, after the fact. <laughs> Oh, you get to ride the golden boy? I, I mean, I assume that I get to keep it. It's like, whose who's horse could it be but mine? How's that dog doing? Is it dying? Did not, you, you kick know, it? Not dogs is and all that. Well, Look at wagging, him. I guess he's wagging his tail. Oh, he wants some belly rubs. Oh, he wanted the belly rubs. Look at how he mined me so good. Oh, yeah, it was these two. I forgot. What's up? I got your horse. You can you can do this one if you want. Oh, don't. look who's finally back home. No doubt about it, that is Princess Zelda's steed for certain. I've been worried sick, but now you've found it. Huh? When did you... Oh, never mind. So, partner, when you show up and save the day in the middle of my reporting work here... Well, it kind of throws me off my saddle. You know what I'm saying? It's a different person. It is a different person. Oh, sorry. Oh, just giving me a hard time. Besides, those good deeds of yours just feather my reputation. The Southern Belle. I love it. <laughs> but uh, is it I just me, or, or has that misplaced pony there gotten kind of attached to you? Aww. I know this horse well, and I do believe you're right. Really, you'd be doing me a favor if you kept this gentle creature. Hell yeah. Princess Zelda asked me to find someone who'd take good care of it. And in your travels around Huru, <laughs> perhaps you'll even have a chance to reunite this horse with the princess. That's very true. Oh, and if, if that's the case, partner, then how could you say no to keeping it? Do it as a favor for the horse, at least. <laughs> it's for the horse. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, I want you to have this, too. Oh, what are you giving me, money? Oh, Royal boy. Bride. Oh, now you can steer that bitch. What does it say? It's gold ornaments leave an impression, but its true value lies in the solid craftsmanship. Also, please take this. Money? The Royal Saddle. Now you can don't have to go bareback. Awesome. Uh -huh. Quit raw dogging that, bear that bear horse. Boy. <laughs> These are bridle and saddle. These are bridle and saddle left behind by Princess Zelda. The little one's accustomed to those. So feel free to use them. I got you. Also, take this Bro, with you. Money. And ooh, some energizing elixir. All right, I did use. I did use some energy. You can get on it. I thought of using this energizing elixir if I had to help calm the horse after it bolted off. But I don't need that anymore, so I'll give it to you. Ah. You might still be a rookie, but you're every bit as good of a reporter as I thought you'd be. <laughs> Thanks to you, I'll have the full story when I write my article. We've worked together to chase two of the stories relating to Princess Zelda. Yep. Go on, add this to your nest egg, partner. <laughs> Money! Some rupees. There it goes, finally. Oh, the there's also this. It's from Tracy. Lucky Gazette Fabric. I don't know what that is. Tough fabric bearing a Lucky Clover Gazette design. We're going to have to look and see what fabric. Oh, it can be used to make a paraglider. Paraglider. Okay, there you go. Oh, you so, can get your own little parry boy. So a Tano's Village dye shop in Nakluda has started up a new service that has something to do with fabrics. Okay. I know, I know. I'm basically giving you an extra job <laughs> by handing this fabric, but still... The point is that by accepting and making use of it, I can show you your officially part of the Lucky Clover Gazette. I'm entertained. <laughs> yeah, I mean. Be nice if Tracy had handled things a bit more simply, though. Anyway, that's all done. It's always great working with you, partner. 
All right, I'm off to the office to write up the whole piece for the paper. Take care now. Let's work together again soon. So long. Hey. 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 And, uh, you know what? Thank you for the reading. And on the next episode, we'll track down Ride the next... Ride the goddamn horse. We'll track down the next piece of the puzzle. All right. That's all time we have for this episode. Please make sure to like and subscribe for Jonas. TNT and... I do declare. It's Mr. X. <laughs> we out, uh...